Welcome back to another episode of Game of Thrones. Where are we at now? What's this? Let's take a look. See what's Everyone happening. Still smells like oh, okay. Shit. Got it. Got outside it. the walls. We'll find Croft here somewhere. Yeah. Somebody got stabbed in the leg. You fighting, right? fighting a dragon. Yeah, oh, better. I don't remember that part. <laughs> Back under the Mad King, they used to say death by sword was a sweet kiss, but fire would fuck you hard. Funny. No. No, not very. <laughs> I'll go find Croft's tent. <laughs> Asher, oh, my. I need you to tell me the truth. I've come a long way to bring you home. Back in that cave, you made a choice. You must have thought only one of us was going to survive. Now, it's not a fair question to ask, but I need to know. I fought beside you, Uncle, too many times to count. I figured you could handle yourself. Beska was the one face to face with a dragon. I appreciate the respect, but it's not about that. It is about Look, that. I can't blame you if your feelings about me are conflicted. Or your feelings about going home. Your family exiled you to this place. But I swore an oath to your mother. Sailed halfway around the world to bring you back safe. And I'll be damned if some dragon fire or your foul decisions are going to stop me. Are we clear? I'm here to help you. To protect you. I understand and I know what's important. My family comes first. That's good to hear. But words are wind, Asher. It's choices that define who we are. Asher, I know where Croft is. This Croft, how well do you know him? Too well. I thought you said you were friends. Yeah, we are. We are. Great friends. Asher fucking Forrester. Son of a poxy whore. Nice. You have some balls walking into my tent after all these years with that mama's monkey grin on your face. Mummers? Well, that went well. All right, maybe I deserve that. That's not even a taste of what you deserve. You never understood consequences, Asher. One stupid mistake cost me an eye. But you never learn. You figured you'd steal from me and I'd just forgive you. <laughs> not a fucking chance. So how are you going to pay me back? Your eye? Your hand? Or how about your tongue? Croft, no! Be reasonable! I am reasonable! I'm letting him fucking choose! My hair could use a trim. Take some off the top, would you? Do not fucking test me! Croft, I deserve your anger as much as Asha. Don't worry, Beska. You're next. Now choose! Or I slice off your balls, Asher. Hey, a hey, hey! A man betrays my trust. There's a price Let paid. him go! Enough! No more fucking about! Fuck you, Croft! Have it your way. You didn't need your testicles anyway. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was bloody beautiful. Fucking Asher. You were pale as a oh. snow bear's ass. Oh. <laughs> are you are you fucking joking? You bloody bastard. <laughs> this is why people steal your shit and take off in the night. Come on, you assholes. Have a drink. <laughs> Joden, the Khaleesi's best wine. Your friend has an interesting sense of humor. So what in seven hells are you two doing here on the arse end of the earth, eh? You're a long way from young guy. We have a proposition for you. Your sword was always the quickest, Croft. I need you and your men to fight for me in Westeros. We need your hellhounds. A hundred good men. <laughs> Am I in a hobby's tip? Would I ever go back to Westeros? I've got it good right here. Her grace pays good coin. I've got wine, women. I've got my own tent. My house is rich, Croft. When this war is won, I'll pay you. More gold than you've ever seen. <laughs> Lord Asher! A fucking highborn thief! Not a chance in seven hells would I believe a promise from you. Now, just a minute. He speaks the truth. 
Aye. Well, it's not up to me. The second sons are sworn to Daenerys Targaryen. I've laid my sword at her feet. For now. Perhaps we could talk to her. She's a little busy right now, commanding a fucking siege. Her enemies are nailing children up on posts for a hundred miles, and a bloody dragon's gone missing. <laughs> but I know where to find her dragon. Ha! <laughs> Unfucking likely. You expect me to believe you've just happened to have seen the one fucking dragon loose in the world? Impossible. Covered in black scales, big orange eyes, and breath like the doom of Valeria. That doesn't prove anything. Enough of this nonsense. I've got proof, you old fuck. Tell me what this is, if not a bloody dragon tooth. Uh, I wouldn't know a dragon tooth from a basilisk dick. Croft. I've seen her dragon. <laughs> <sighs> oh, bugger me with a bloody spear. <laughs> oh, man. If you're lying about this, it'll cost more than your balls. Fair enough. Oh. Come on, you son of a bitch. The beast's name is Drogon. She'll want to hear about him right away. And don't think you're going to charm her with that fucking Asher grin. Yes, I will. <laughs> All right, continuing on. This is going to split us up somewhere else. I know it is. Yeah, back to the north. Game of Thrones on the TV show, HBO TV show, is good about this. It shows you like five minutes of it of an area, and then it moves on to a different area. So they got like twenty different things going on at the same time. Day tomorrow, this game's isn't doing it? the exact same thing. Off to Craster's Keep. Assuming you're not too busy looking for your North Grove. I thought you didn't believe in it. Not saying I do. But if it was real, can you trust Potter with it? You ask me. There's just something off about him. Aside from him being an oily thief, I mean. <sighs> He's holding something back. Cotter's not a bad sort. I trust him. Even after he tried stealing your map? <sighs> Who's he like? Well, if we're going out there tomorrow, in the middle of fucking nowhere, I'd want to know who I can trust. Finn, get back on watch until your relief arrives. They're late. You think Mance Raider is gonna wait for them? Right! Asshole. And Tuttle, you've got torches that have gone out. Keep them lit. Let the wildlings know we're still home. This one's still good. <laughs> really? That's ironwood for sure. That's using it. Uncle Duncan brought these from Ironrath. Wonder if I'll ever see it again. If anyone tries coming over the wall, well, those will stop them. everything. I clicked on everything. Can I go this way?
will be here soon. Wonder who's riding it. Solid ice. Pig farmer. A 300 mile walk, and you're still in my way. I figured we'd settle things on the way to Crasters, but this is even better. The wall's a dangerous place. People slip off all the time. Still have some fighting spirit left in you, huh? I did duty to my lord back on that bloody farm. And for doing a proper job of it, what I get? Banished to the fucking wall! I never did tell you about your father, did I? We bled him at first, like a pig. Seemed only fair he should feel what it's like. Near the end, he could barely breathe. Kept begging us to leave your sister alone. So I made sure he was still alive when she started screaming. It was the last thing your father ever heard. The more we sliced, the worse it got. Shrieking the whole time. You're not worth it. I didn't come here to chat, you fucking cunt. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, come on now. Too bad your father didn't fight like that. Might still be alive. And I thought you were going to make this easy. You're going to die for what you did! Jon Snow can't hold your hand now. Let's see if you scream like you're s- You got lucky, pig farmer. You're going to slaughter me. Like my man back at your farm. At least let me have my sword. Keep it interesting. Or are you afraid? Take your sword. When you die, you'll know you weren't good enough. So noble, you fucking cunt. <sighs> I know he's going over the side. Let's fucking finish it. Go on. Don't piss yourself on the way down. Get in trouble. Oh, okay, sir. My lord, our people are starving and afraid. 
The White Hills have driven them away from the ironwood groves. Out of the way! And so they come to us, looking for food. Food we don't have to spare. How can we support an army and retain our position in the north? We can't even feed the people we see before us. It's like the dead of winter's come. And it doesn't look like it's getting better. No one has more fight in them than Asher. I'm sure he and Malcolm will find us the army we need. Well, I hope we can figure something out. As long as the White Hills are in our house, we have to be careful. Come on, you! Let me go! You can't do this! God! Uh, You're here! Uh, Look! Look at this! Uh, did you see what this girl did? She attacked my man like an animal! Bloody bit me! Yeah, now it's her turn! Uh, She's gonna get what she has coming to her! This won't go unpunished! Let go of me! I don't care if she's your sister! She bit your man? How did that happen? What did he do to her? That doesn't matter. It matters what she did. Mm. I saw him stealing from our kitchen, and I told him to stop. He laid his hands on me, so I bit him. You bloody wench! I was only doing what had to be done. I warned you not to mistreat my men. Someone will have to answer for this. Do you hear me? Don't make this ugly. Thieves have to be punished, so your man got what he deserved. He's lucky he didn't get any worse than that. So you've given over your duties to this girl, then? Or can you not control your sister? Don't listen to him, Roderick. And if you can't rein her in, yeah, what about the rest of them? It's about time she saw a real lord again and learned proper discipline. Are you afraid of a young girl with all the armed soldiers you have? What? I'm not afraid! I, I want order! But this house is in a shambles. And the problem starts at the top, Roderick. Careful, boy. You yourself had the gall to strike one of my men. And that's the real problem with you foresters. You're too fucking proud. Always have been. It was bad enough when you were above us. And now it's even worse. Because you don't see how far you've fallen. Still high enough to look down at you. Wait. Forgive her. Forgive her. The passions of youth. No one questions your authority, Griff. You have the power. Oh, I like him. You thought this was your man, Roderick? He's mine. A dog to be sure, but my dog. That's how I like to see you, foresters. Obedient servants, eager to please your master. He's a loyal member of my house, a man of peace, and he deserves to be treated as such. You don't get it, do you? You foresters need to learn when you're beaten. <laughs> you will learn some fucking humility. Oh, this won't be the last lesson I teach you foresters. Have you no honor? I'll run you through for that. I'll cut you down like straw men. I'll fucking kill you myself. No. Make him watch this. I bet this makes you angry, eh? You probably want to get up and hit me. But we know how that would go, don't we? Now, are you going to be a good little forester, learn your lesson, and stay down? Roderick! I will not yield. You bloody snot. <laughs> Why don't you fucking get it? <laughs> get up, Roderick! Stay down, my lord. Your brother Ethan didn't know his place either. Ramsay Snow taught him good. 
Talia here will meet the same end. Unless you're a good little forester, you learn your place and stay down. Some forester is going to learn their lesson today. You don't have to do that, Lord Griff. Oh, I'll stay down. Consider this even, girl. Your brother learned the lesson for you. You'd be wise to follow his lead. As would all of you. Your lord is a smart man. First in his line that understands. Now you need to understand too. You can be lord, Roderick. So long as we all know who holds the reins here. Come on. You did the right thing, my son. You had to submit. Aye. A true lord. But we... We let them win. All right, thanks for coming out and checking out this episode of Game of Thrones. It's getting interesting. Okay, guys, come on back for the next episode.